Alright, last time. Plot happened, and New Arcadia decided to do a full-on attack on the Resistance base, which is why that Reploid is dead in the corner. So, as the Resident Zero, we are going to have to drive them back. Should be fairly easy, and well, it kind of is other than the boss. This mission is fairly short and, again, easy. And actually, you don't have to go this way. I'm just doing it because I want to get more enemy kills, because... And that's probably going to be the weakest portion of my mission thing, mission results. It's usually either that or time, which is honestly kind of conflicting, really, because the game's like, hey, go out of your way and kill those enemies. Hey, you went out of your way. You need to complete this mission, mission faster, you jackass. And, yep, we could have just come right down here and go in there, but I want to kill extra enemies, which I'm going to go and do over here, too, so be right back. I don't know why I do this. They just respawn immediately. Anyway, let's see how Servo is doing. In a corner, shaking. Okay, aren't you the weapons expert? Shouldn't, couldn't you have just made an energy knife or something and just janked the guys that were, you know, there? I mean, they weren't really threatening. I mean, despite the fact that they're in here, they just paid you no mind whatsoever. They were just sort of shuffling around. Guess, I guess the party's in the engine room. They were just pacing around like it was 1999 or something. Anyway, that's done. I'm going to equip the electricity chip for no reason whatsoever. Whistle, whistle, whistle. And I must admit, I actually kind of like that there are so many Pantheon warriors in this mission because, you know, it actually shows that Neo Arcadia is trying this time. Plus, it actually makes sense that the Reploids, or the Resistance members, are losing because, well... These guys are kind of difficult for Zero, and Resistance guys only have busters to work with, so they're kind of screwed if they go up against these guys. And by the way, just a quick note, uh, remember when we fought Diggy Man? Uh, if we failed to kill him and he exploded inside the Resistance base, we actually would have gone to this mission, apparently. Again, it's never happened to me, but eh, it can happen, apparently. And here we have the hardest boss in the game. That's right, a monkey. And not only that, he's a monkey in the stealth unit. Because apparently one day, pa Phantom was just looking at one of those symbol monkeys, and he was just like, I want him in my army. Uh, but sir, how would that be practical? I, I want him in my army. And then they made a monkey robot and named him after the Monkey King from, like, Indian lore, I think. I think that's it. Anyway, yeah, he's the hardest boss in the game. Pretty much because he is pretty much one of the most erratic guys. He can make these little mini monkeys, which he did twice in a row, which is good because if you kill five of them, you get a cyber elf. He can also do this attack, which isn't too hard to dodge, actually. And of course, you saw he had that sort of flame whirl attack. That's also not too bad to dodge. Really, he's just difficult because if he decides to run at you a lot, he can probably hit you because, again, he's very erratic. He's very abrupt, really. He can just he can sort of chain attacks, really. But I killed him in midair. Just chopped him in half in midair. I swear he's difficult. I just had a very lucky break because he apparently decided to spam mini monkeys at me. If he would, if he just decided to break out into a run like after every move, I probably would have died. And holy shit, that was actually pretty good. If I just took like one less hit, maybe, maybe two. But yeah, that wasn't too bad, despite you know fighting the hardest boss in the game. I swear he's difficult. That's a pretty terrible design.
I love Zero's reaction here. Huh, that familiar guy. Huh, who could he possibly... Did he say we can use a transserver? But anyway, yeah, we're all on the same page, right? I mean, apparently the characters can't figure it out, but we all know that's the spirit of the original X, right? That was made fairly obvious, right? So, looks like it's finally time to take the fight to Neo Arcadia. We're actually going to be on the offensive for once. So, next time, we're going to travel to New York, Arcadia, and we're going to zero all over the place. Ew.